We're going to make coconut milk and to do that I need some fresh or frozen coconut meat which comes from this type of coconut, mature brown coconut. This meat that I've got here is fresh but frozen here from our local coconuts. I've got about 350 grams more or less and then I've got, because it's frozen coconut meat, I've got 750 mils of hot water which I'm going to add in here. If you're using fresh meat, you don't need to put the hot water in. It just helps it blend together. We're going to turn this on, and it really helps if you've got something like a Vitamix or a very high powered blender. I'm going to put it on high. Ideally, you'd let that run for at least a minute, if not a minute and a half. I actually have some that I pre did, so I don't have to keep blending for ages. This isn't what it should look like. You're going to need a nut milk bag. If you don't have a nut milk bag, uh, which are quite easy, easy to find, you can actually use a very fine knit t-shirt or something like a uh, pair of stockings even, which I've, I've done before. Pour the mixture into the nut milk bag and then you're going to squeeze that out and there you have beautiful fresh coconut milk ready to drink.